Welcome to the beautiful new location of Stoughton Health Home Health Department right here on the corner of 51 and Highway B. Victoria, tell us about the exciting news that Stoughton Health has to share about this new beautiful building. Sure, Stoughton Health was gifted this building from McFarland State Bank and we are now housing our Community Health and Wellness Center in this building and we also have our Home Health Department that is housed out of here as well. So Home Health, take us through what that means and the scope of things that home health providers cover. Sure, home health providers cover uh, physical therapy, occupational therapy, skilled nursing services, and we also have home health aides to assist with bathing and other activities of daily living that our clients need assistance with. I would imagine through this type of care, bonds and friendships are, are truly built. Yes, and I think that's one of the, the strengths of a, of a home health program is those relationships that we build with our clients and our patients in the home health program. When you are actually sitting down at someone's kitchen table or you're sitting across from them on a sofa or you're sitting in their bedroom and you're, you're talking to them about some of their most intimate needs and what their um, what their cares are. You form a bond with that person that lasts for a very long time. Absolutely. Now during this COVID-19 time, obviously there's a risk with coming into contact with people, but it's something, it's still a service that you need to provide. How are you and all of the providers really making sure that everybody is the safest that they can be? Yes, we do screening upon entering into the home. We are masking, we are following all the CDC recommendations and guidelines and uh, doing everything that we can with our checklist to make sure that we are providing that high quality care and keeping our patients safe. I'm hoping they'll let me go along to this first home health patient. I'm Emmy Fink and you're buzzed into Madison.